Hello and welcome to an Oasis installation guide for Borderlands Game of the Year Enhanced. Now, it's a little bit different in how to install it compared to the original game because this game does everything a little bit different and some stuff doesn't work anymore and the mod is very old. But it still works if you do it in a very certain way. Step one, go download the Oasis Map Hub. It'll be in the description. It's on the Nexus. Go download this file right here. And while you're at it, download the second file, which is a link to Dropbox for mapslot1.umap. Once you've downloaded this, uh, you should have this RAR file. And it'll have some files in it. A bat file, which you can ignore. You can delete that. You don't need it. And a readme, which you should probably read. And it also has a binary file here, UE Shader Compile Worker. Uh, I do not believe you need that anymore. I'm not sure. It, just in case... I don't know if you still need it, but put it in your binaries inside of Borderlands Game Near Enhanced here. Again, I do not know if you need it anymore, but just put it there just in case. Anyways, you're going to want to merge this Willow Game file with your Willow Game file inside of your installation. And what this will do is it will put... Uh, let's see, there we go. It will put two new folders in here, Oasis and Map Slots. Now this is not enough to make it work. In the old version, this was enough. All you had to do was this and then open up Willow Tree and then edit the fast travel location in and you were done. This no longer works. What you have to do now is go into the Oasis folder that you put in here. Take this w underscore scrap oasis underscore p dot umap file. And don't worry if you don't see dot umap, uh, then you don't have Windows extensions uh, or Windows type extensions for the names. It should still say umap file. Copy this. Make a copy of that and go to your folder in the maps that says arid. Go in here. You should have a file called arid underscore arena underscore coliseum underscore p dot umap. Paste your oasis file in here and rename it into Again, arid underscore arena underscore coliseum underscore p dot umap. Rename it to that. Now I've already done it. This file right here is actually the Oasis file. I've already renamed it. Here's my backed up file. This is the original file I made a backup. And you should too. Make a backup. But anyways, once you've done that, once you've added it, I'm just going to delete this because we already have it in there. Renamed. Once you've done that, take my map slot one dot umap and put that inside of map slots. Replace map slot one or any map slot that you want to replace you just have to rename it but i recommend one once you have done this you can launch your game and head to the arid badlands like i am in right now let me just fast travel to where you would actually be you'll be here in firestone and all you're going to want to do is head over to where the old pvp arena used to be that is what you have replaced Previously, you could just add Oasis and, you know, edit in the fast travel locations through Willow Tree. But if you add those fast travel locations now, it just does not work. I am not sure why not, but it just does not work anymore. Maybe if it gets updated one day, maybe it will. But as of right now, you have to do this. Once you replace the arena, you can come to this arena right here, which is located right there in the Ad Badlands. That's where Firestone is. And you're going to enter this Firestone Coliseum. And it will tell you that you're entering the Firestone Coliseum. But in fact, you are not entering the Firestone Coliseum at all. Once you arrive here, you will receive the Firestone Coliseum fast travel point. So now, anytime you want, you can go to Firestone Coliseum. And here we are. Now, your grass is probably going to get be glitched. Mine works because I've done some other modding. But your grass is going to be big blocky squares. Do not worry about that. Only the grass in this area is bugged. It's because the grass is the original Borderlands 1 textures, not the new ones. Here you can cycle between different maps available. But of course, we've only replaced the first map. All these other ones are placeholder. There's nothing in them. It's just a blank room. A blank room with a teleporter. You're going to go into map 1, which is the one we replaced with the DLC teleporter. Which again, I did not make. I don't don't give me credits for this area. I do not know who made this. 
I can't find the credits for it anymore. I've downloaded this off of someone else on Reddit. Uh, but whoever made this, thank you. Now you'll see a big red uh, handprint on the screen. I don't know what's causing that. It's probably a weird lighting glitch. It only affects this area. Don't worry about it. So in this first area, you have teleporters to all of the areas in the, fir in the blah, blah, fourth DLC. Tartarus Station, Wayward Pass, Sanders Gorge, stuff like that. And if you ride this elevator down, you can teleport to the third DLC's area. So you can go to the Circle of Duty if you need to. You could go fight Cromerax easier by going there. Uh, maybe you need to visit Moxie you can go to Deep Fathoms. Maybe you want to do the Armory, you can go there and do really quick Armory farms. In here, you can travel to the Jacob's Cove areas, right here, as you can see. And then here, you can travel to the first three arenas or the three advanced arenas. Anyways, to show you that this works, let's try one of these. Uh, what one would be interesting? Uh, the armory one. Let's say you want to do quick armory runs, you just click that one. Boom! You are now in the armory. You can go do your armory glitch all you want. And there you go, that's how you install it. Remember, if you want to enter the original Firestone Coliseum Arena again, you need to re uh, replace it with your backup. Because that map is essentially gone now. You've replaced it completely. This is the current only way to get Oasis working. If there are more ways in the future, I'll make videos on them. But as of right now, until Oasis gets an update, this is how you access it. Thank you all for watching. Hope y'all enjoyed the video. Tell me what you thought in the comments or whatever. I read them all. Thank y'all. See you later. Toodles.